May sat in a dimly lit building, fighting the depths of unconsciousness. She's amazed that she hadn't passed out by now. Her strength had returned, and she lifted her head, looking up at Thomas. He stood smug, glaring down at her. Another contraction came, and May screamed in agony. Instinctively, she wanted to curl into the fetal position, but her arms had been tied behind her back. Her legs were connected to each portion of the chair. Blood from her head injury blinded her eyes. A dirty cloth was tied tightly around her mouth, causing the sides of her mouth to tear. Soon, I will bring your baby into the world and let you watch as I kill him. Then, I'm going to slowly kill you. The madman took the form of a demon in May's eyes. May fought back the tears. She had known that something terrible was about to happen when she had met her mother for lunch. Now, May was convinced that this had been arranged by song. May never would have thought her mother could be capable of something like this. But what was she to think now? Why would Thomas snatch her from the same restaurant? He had perfect timing, dragging her from the booth and shoving a gun in her side. May could only think about saving her baby, no matter what.